What the heck is going on everybody? In this video we will learn to convert Android layouts into images just like what happens in Instagram stories where you put many items to the layout such as images or text views and then when you click on post story then that layout is converted into an image and it is sent to a server. So add a relative layout inside this relative layout set width and height to wrap content and give this an ID of relative layout. Then add a text view, set width to match parent and height to 200 dp and give this a text. My name is Slim Shady. By the way guys, I love Slim Shady. If you do too, then uh, we are friends. Yes, we are friends. And then gravity will be center text size will be 22 sp background will be black text color will be white and we will convert this layout this relative layout into an image and we will show that image in our image view this image view will be below our relative layout and give this an ID of image view and all this process will happen when we press a button give this a button ID now go to mainactivity.java file and have a reference to all the UI elements we have a button we have a relative layout and then we have an image view and when this button is clicked then we will do our stuff so first we will create a bitmap and size of this bitmap will be same as of our relative layout so get the width of the relative layout and pass it as the first parameter then we have the height of the relative layout and the last parameter is the config type we will pass config.argb underscore for it. This will give a good quality image. And also each pixel is stored in four bytes of memory when you set the config type to this. Now we can create an object of canvas and pass the bitmap as its parameter. And then we can draw our relative layout on this canvas. And finally, we can show the bitmap in our image view. Now, these four lines may look confusing, but they are really simple. Let me explain this to you again. First of all, we are creating a bitmap having size equal to our relative layout. And then we are drawing our relative layout on the canvas. And then we are drawing that canvas on the bitmap. And lastly, we are showing that bitmap in our image view. Okay, so now we can run and test what we have created. Click on this button and this thing works perfectly and if you like this video then give this a like and subscribe to the channel for more awesome content